I, I did have one question. Uh, okay. One over F equal, equals one over P plus one over Q. Is that for uh, concave or convex? I forget. Both. It, the difference is where you put the plus and minus signs. So if it is convex, the focal length is positive. If it's concave, the focal length is negative. Right. Right, because I can picture it right. I the just image, the image gets smaller on concave, so I, I think you're right. So concave, focal length is positive. Convex with the image over here, focal length is negative. Okay, thank you. I just uh, have forgot. And P. Potentially, P could be negative, but for everything we've done so far, P is a positive number for now. And we'll, when we get into lenses, we'll talk about when P is a negative number. And then Q positive means real image. In other words, light rays actually meet. It's now on the other side of the mirror, right? And then less than zero is a virtual image. The light rays just appear to meet to our human perception. Yeah, I just, uh, I forgot it's all. Since you said we, you mentioned talking about lenses, are we doing the lens maker equation today after uh, doing that? After continuing the lab with the mirror or? Yeah, so you got the, the, the big one right there and then the other, uh, we'll call it the optical bench lab. Optical bench lab? Yeah, that on the top of the shelves over there, what you used when we were doing the intense. Um, right, uh, the luminance. Thank you, luminance. Illuminance. It's, I guess, yeah. technically, luminance is what. Uh, like uh, off of something. My, eye, my eye was a little soft on that. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. Okay. That is kind of confusing. I mean, who? I mean, it's like, I mean, uh, who were the, who, what were the guys who came up with these terms thinking when they said they, what were they thinking? Probably just thinking about Greek and Latin because they were probably all fluent in it. Well, probably. Yeah, that sums it up right. Not. I have a white hair on my knuckle. Ooh, getting old. Like a long one. That's, That's interesting. I right. also dropped a vanity on my knuckle last night. That was fun. Ooh. Yeah, big old 72 inch that I was ripping off my vanity. I, got, I found a new one for $150. Okay. At a discount uh, building supply. Same one, too. I'm so <laughs> I'm glad you seem to be okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, Nothing's I, broken. I mean, it's all moving. From the way I roll, I, I would say don't drop things on your hands, but yeah. you know, <laughs> you be you. Actually, it got, because I forgot to do one piece of piping, it caught between the piping that was already on it and then the piping. Oh! Ouch! Okay. <laughs> uh, There we go, one more. Hey, Thomas. So. All right, any questions since you got the chapter 34 quiz today? Any questions on the chapter 34 questions? I mean, you kind of explained my question. It's on the, on the um, homework here. It was asking if it's virtual or real, and we didn't really cover that in our discussion. Ah. But, but, but now, now I know. <laughs> and virtual, those, the terminology of real is where the light rays actually meet, and virtual where it only appears to meet uh, is going to be common language when we do lenses as well. Okay. Is it like lenses like, like, with like these kinds of lenses? Yeah, we'll, we'll be more simplistic than that, but yes. Okay, okay, okay. 
virtual is just another way of saying on the other side of the mirror, right? Right. A more uh, fancy way of saying it. Yeah, the reason why they use the term virtual there is that when you get to thin lenses, the real image will be on the other side of the lens and virtual will be on the same side of the lens. Oh. So the, but virtual still is where the light rays, or the light rays don't actually meet. Okay. All right, any other questions at the moment? I think I'm ready for this. All right, I'm gonna grab them. Hopefully uh, it doesn't kick my butt. Has anyone started doing test corrections? What are they do? Uh, they're due at the end of the month. That was just, I was just wondering if anyone ever started like being proactive or whatnot. I don't start with that. Oh, some good news. I got the first shot of the vaccine. Okay. That's good. Uh, arm was just a tad bit sore for a little bit, and other than that.